Grinner Mortals. You are watching Dead Grins Customs. Like this video and subscribe to this channel before I destroy you all. Don't you like this color? Isn't it as beautiful as his customs? Go on, worship this channel or else. Hey Dead Grinners, this is Dead Grin and welcome to another episode of Dead Grin's Customs. In today's episode, I'm going to show you guys how to um, add an earring or a Potara earring to one of your figures. Now, I've asked a lot of people and nobody can really give me answers. It's kind of annoying. Like if you see this guy, like he has one. It looks kind of weird at the same time, like... Obviously, it's like a part of the mold, you know, it's not like something attached. The SH Figure Arts ones, they, they, they do it really good, too. So, what I wanted to do is sort of, uh, find out if there was a way to be able to do it. Now, a while back, you guys should remember, I did my uh, Super Saiyan 4 Rose Goku Black. And uh, one of my friends, his name is Herman, I'm going to leave a link to his um, Instagram at the end of this uh, video. What he ended up using was these kind of like uh, the points on these brushes. That was ingenious when I saw him do that with his Vegito. Uh, I went to one of my local dollar stores and I found it. And I mean, it wasn't that much. So what I did is that I... Um, you know, I used the these little cutting tool, and I cut off one from here. Well, actually, I cut a couple because I didn't know which one was going to be able to be best. And then I found one of my uh, screws that could uh, make a hole big enough for it. And um, I left just long enough, and I made it deep enough to where I could be able to place it with my hand. kind of awkward to do it on camera now that I'm actually trying ah. let me see if I can do it off camera guys and there you go just cut it down long enough or make the hole deep enough to where you find it comfortable I like I like it like this I've gotten opinions from some of my friends on uh, Instagram and some on uh, Facebook and some of them told me, I mean, most of, almost all of them told me that the same thing, that it looks good since it's kind of dangling like real Patara instead of, you know, being basically caked on like, uh, like the actual Dragon Stars ones do. So, like I said, guys, just, you know, get a little brush, cut one of the tips to obviously to the length that you want. If you can get this tool, I'm not sure what it's called anymore, just a little drill. And uh, just drill in a hole. Try to make it underneath the ear, but where there's still enough plastic, you know, to be able to play around with. And then just make it as deep as you need for uh, like the way you want it to dangle, basically. So, quick little thing, guys. Hopefully, you guys liked it. Um, quick, easy way to add Patara earrings to any of your uh, Dragon Stars figures. All right. So, this is uh, Dead Grin signing out. Peace. Well, that's the end of that video, guys. Remember to visit Franken Culture at frankenculture.com where you can follow my blog and YouTube posts. You can also follow them on Instagram, Twitter, and Facebook. And you can also follow me, Dead Grins Customs, on those same social media platforms. Remember to hit the like button and subscribe if you haven't already. Share this video. And let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I always love to hear what you guys have to say. Remember, if you're watching this in the morning, good morning, and for everybody else, good afternoon, good evening, and good night.